Hi, everyone. Uh, yeah, I'm Federico Salarini or something like that. Um, and this person right next to me looks like Robert Henke, but it's not Robert Henke. It's actually Gio Herrera. And, right? How are you doing, Gio? It sounds great. Okay, see? So, Gio's actually here with me, checking out this thing that we got going on here. It's not, not a big deal, nothing too pretentious. It's just basically an MSP port of the CSUM polynomial wave shaper. So, it's basically a distortion unit based on polynomial evaluation. And I'm basically giving it away for free. So, it's at the Xbox 74, like, uh, thing, the Wi-Fi thing we have going on in the share folder, and Jill is totally digging it, and yeah, and basically I'm giving away the, the, the MSP object for free and the source code if anyone wants it. Jill really likes it, and she's actually going to tell Robert Henke to download it because he might find it useful, Woo! and yeah. Hi, my name is John Rose with Demand Evolution, demoing our open source Max multi-touch controlling software. So it basically can support any amount of touches and infrared input. So you can use infrared light sources, paint brushes, and as well you can use touch to control any of the Max objects that are in presentation mode. And it basically allows you to hook in with any Max controllable application or hardware using multi-touch UI control. All right, so I'm John Arroyo with uh, Remixin, and this is a project I've been working on for a little while now. But we just launched the website a few months ago, and essentially it's a place to um, share your music and let people remix it. So you can share things, you can share stems, you can share remix kits. Uh, now I just added a feature where you can share Max patches. So if you have a Max patch, you can upload to the site, let people remix it, upload the patch back, and people can remix the remix. So after a while, you have an ongoing chain of iterative remixes, either from the stems or from your Max patch, and you're going to keep things growing from there. Okay. Hi, I'm James Charlton uh, from New Auckland, New Zealand, uh, Auckland University of Technology. I'm here with these little babies. Uh, this is a jitter object in the crudest sense. It's um, a printout from Jitter GL form that was generated by processing uh, video to accumulate the pixel values mapped to a cone, a cylinder, sorry, and um, then exported as an STL file to a 3D printer. It's also here with um, a parody of that, which is a, a mechanical clay deforming machine that um, I couldn't ship all the way from New Zealand, but uh, it's here in video. Okay, the things I've been working on for the last few years is the notion of meta-creation, or having machines exhibit creative behaviors. And so that all is uh, moving beyond randomness and pro mere probability, but uh, actually using ideas from artificial intelligence, um, evolutionary art, and machine learning. So I have three examples here. One is uh, multi intelligent multi-agents that interact with each other in a uh, percussion ensemble. Another one uses, another example uses a um, a genetic algorithm to create a population of rhythms and the third one is uh, using a self-organizing map to uh, uh, generate or discover similarities within a sample database.